We were invited by the Americana Music Association UK to their gig Americana Fest down in Hackney in London. An array of stars and bands turned out. It was a terrific night. Check this out, you really are going to enjoy it. Hazel here for the UK Americana Bar at the UK Americana Festival here in Hackney. This is one of the three venues, the Moth Club. I'm here with Balin and Howard from AMA UK. Please tell me a little bit more about what AMA UK is, what do you do? Well, we promote uh, Americana music in the UK. That's our main focus. We, we give a platform to artists that uh, ply their trade in Americana. We support them, uh, we showcase them, and uh, we award them. <laughs> Which is basically what today and tomorrow is all about. That's what it's all That's about. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. My first tour over here was last summer, right. and I had an absolute blast and put some really, some really fun places. Got a chance to play at Cambridge Folk Festival and um, wow. And yeah, so and the uh, Edinburgh Jazz and Blues Festival. Got a chance to play that. So Edinburgh's a fun place, right? Yeah, I had a chance to actually hang out there for about four days because I was a friend of mine that offered my had a spare room and let me stay. So I was able to hang out in Edinburgh for like four days and go see some shows. At the festival and uh, so anyway I had fun last time and definitely want to come back to the UK Outside the Oslo in Hackney, uh, this is the second venue that's going to be showing some brilliant acts, all part of the UK Americana Festival. There's going to be 20 acts in total across three different venues. We're going to pop inside and see what's going on. Tell us a little bit more about Wild Ponies. Well, we are, are based out of East Nashville, Tennessee. We're both from Virginia originally, from the Appalachian Mountains of mm. Virginia. And we've been in East Nashville for about six years. And wow. we come over to tour the UK like once or twice a year, usually. That's quite, quite regularly. We love yeah, it's it. Good. We love it over here. Yeah, it's yeah, great. It's all right over here. It's, it's all right. So great. Last year, we had a double whammy. We had our awards here in London and we launched the Americana chart which is the official charts company's official genre chart for Americana. So you're going to take your mother, your husband, and your, your wife, and everything else, and your, your manager's double base uh, to Australia soon. We yeah. absolutely yes. are. Yeah, in um, in April we're uh, we're going over there for the first time. We're going to live for a couple of weeks, mm -hmm. and we're going to um, uh, we're going to take our run the bluegrass over to them and see if they enjoy. And what's really great from our perspective is uh, not only is there a, a love for this music, but people are supporting it. You know, it's quite easy to say that you love something and, and to maybe stream it at home or to listen to it when it's on the radio, but to actually purchase tickets to get out of your house on a, on a wet February night and come out to Hackney <laughs> and watch some bands, that's really heartening for us. So tell us a little bit more about what we're going to hear from you in about 20 minutes. Um, yeah, we um, <coughs> an Americana duo, lots of close harmonies. We met um, about a year and a half ago when we were both supporting Joan Armour Trading on tour. Oh, okay. And um, yeah, we've been playing since then. We've just finished recording our second EP, which is coming out soon. <laughs> soon? 
And the atmosphere is absolutely incredible in all of these venues as well. So I think that that's going to just filter back to everybody. And I don't know how many venues you're going to have next year. So it's going to be more than three. It might be more than three, but the atmosphere is really important for us as well. And I think that's one of the great things about Americana. And I don't know that it's specific to Americana, but it's certainly one of the great things about Americana is that it's a real community. And that's a word that people use a lot. You know, yeah. not only is it a community of fans, but it's a community of artists as well. And there's a collaboration between artists and uh, there's a real support network there as well. We are outside the third venue here in Hackney for the UK Americana Festival. It is Perfect Chicken. Wait, no, 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 that's not right. Wait a minute, this way. Paper Dress Vintage, the third venue. Let's go in and see what's going on. Tell us a little bit more about your set later. Yeah, so uh, we're here from Canada. I've got a bass player and a guitar player with me, and uh, we sing three part harmonies, and um, we're all from Ontario, so it's a province in Canada. I'm from Ottawa, and uh, the bass player is from Toronto, and the guitar player is also from Ottawa. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Okay, so um, obviously you're here at the moment. Are you playing anywhere else in the UK? Yeah, this is actually the la uh, third last show in a month-long tour in England. Wow. So yeah, we're excited to play this festival and, and get to be back in London. And there's a lot of people at this festival tonight as well that have, that have come from Canada, from Nashville, from all over the place. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah, and that was really heartening for us because, you know, when we got the application, say, for, for the showcases, there were artists from all over the world. And, um, and, and that was exciting for us because it meant that people wanted to come here and be a part of this. You know, it wasn't just people in our own backyard. It wasn't just people from the UK. It was people who wanted to come from all around the world and showcase here and be a part of this. And it's a variety as well. Yeah. Follow, like, check it out. Yeah, keep absolutely. Involved and support yeah, it. absolutely. Because this, even though it says Americana and it has the word America in it, this is music for everywhere. This is UK artists make this music. Yep. Uh, artists from Europe make this music. Artists from South America make this music. This is music that can be made anywhere. You don't have to be born in the hills of Tennessee like me. You can be from anywhere. <laughs> One random <laughs> fact about each other. Start with okay. <laughs> Come on then, Mikey. Random fact. Um, or I didn't know that F's and TH's were pronounced differently until I was 21. I have flat feet. He does have flat feet. He does. Very big flat feet. I'm like a seal when I swim, I just whiz off in the distance. A whiz off? That's quite good. That's fine. I used to think a sachet was pronounced satchit. <laughs> and I said that up until, up until about four weeks ago. And I love metal detecting. Mm. I've kissed every single book I've ever read. <laughs> Tom. Well, thank you for chatting to us here at the uh, UK Americana Bar. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you for coming. Uh, thank you. No, I'm really enjoying it. And thank it. you for doing what you're doing because what you're doing is just as important as what we're doing. You are very welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck for tomorrow as well. Thank you. Thanks very much.